Welcome back everybody to Comic Related's YouTube channel. I am Brant Fowler, back with you for some more San Diego Comic Con news. Today, Saturday, day three of the convention, Legendary Pictures held their panel announcing upcoming uh, projects, giving more details on the projects. First up, they did a little Godzilla 2 teaser. They had uh, a pre-recorded taping from director um, Gareth Edwards talking about Godzilla 2 and saying that you know, all the creatures that were going to be in it, but it was completely bleeped out. So we didn't get that, but we did find out later on that creatures that will be in there are, uh, well, actually I'll say that in a minute, but before I do that, there were tags throughout this little teaser that they showed, one that says there is still one secret that remains hidden. There are others. And then it says monarch assessment, conflict imminent, let them fight. And we learned that Mothra, uh, King Ghidorah, uh, I, I'm sure I butchered that name, and uh, Rodan, or Rodan are going to be in Godzilla 2, so we have that to look forward to. They also showed footage from As Above, So Below. Uh, this is a film uh, that takes place in the catacombs of Paris, France, and this is the... this team of filmmakers were the first that were ever allowed to film in the restricted area of the catacombs. Uh, very interesting. Michael Mann uh, made a surprise appearance on the panel, his first ever Comic-Con appearance, talking about another project starring Chris Hemsworth from Thor fame called Black Hat. This is a cyber crime story uh, that explores uh, what happens when a hacker kind of takes down everything, there's footage of a nuclear plant blowing up. Uh, it's, you know, all this cyber warfare and everything. Very interesting stuff. Also, um, Guillermo del Toro was up next to talk about his movie Crimson Peak horror flick starring another Thor alumni, Tom Hiddleston. Uh, and the trailer or teaser that they showed had Hiddleston narrating and I will read this narration even though you can read it in the article below and I'm sure I won't do as good a job as Mr. Hiddleston but a house as old as this one becomes in time a living thing timber for bones and winds for eyes and sitting there all alone it starts holding on to things keeping them alive when they shouldn't be some of them good some are bad some should never be spoken about again and all the while there is a, a creepy house they're showing and a child sitting cowering on the bed before a dark hand grabs her shoulder. So that's the peak that the fans in attendance got. They also talked a little bit about Pacific Rim 2. They released, uh, Legendary Pictures did, on their YouTube channel a video which is in the story below. Um, so you can watch it there. Of uh, Pacific Rim 2 footage. So that is up. Warcraft was also talked about. Um, they showed some t uh, very short footage at the panel. We did not get to see that. All we got to see was a logo graphic popping up on screen that says Warcraft. The movie is a year and a half away. Debuts on March 2016. So we have that to look forward to. Real quick, going back to Guillermo del, del Toro. He did say to the fans, Hellboy 3 and At the Mountains of Madness. To which uh, Le Legendary Pictures president uh, um, Tall said... Uh, Let's get Pacific Rim 2 finished and then we'll talk. So we'll see what happens with there with those uh, two films, especially Hellboy 3. I'm excited for it if it does in fact happen. Then they showed some footage from a movie called Skull Island. And you can kind of surmise what that is referring to. We have an individual story which will also be linked below about the new King Kong flick from Legendary Pictures. And that was a wrap for Legendary Pictures panel at San Diego Comic Con. Check out all the other coverage on ComicRelated.com, ComicFrontline.com, and our respective YouTube channels. Check out the hub, and keep coming back here for more. So, thanks for watching, and as always, remember, if it's comic related, you'll find it here.